Hey everybody, welcome to the AMHA Youth Network video series. Um, my name is Sophie Proctor and I am the Vice President of Public Relations on the Youth Council. And I'm gonna let Clea introduce herself. Hi, I'm Clea Cater, I'm Vice President of Disciplines on the Youth Council. Um, and we are part of the committee that has put together this first video for you guys. This is just to teach you all about the AMHA Youth Council um, so we're going to let you guys watch the video we made introducing everyone, um, and then we're going to open it up to a little Q&A at the end, okay? Clea is going to put the video on. It might just take a second. Thanks for joining us tonight, everybody. is made up of Morgan loving youth from across the nation. And we hold monthly telephone conferences discussing youth programs, youth involvement, and community service. The Youth Council Director is Nikki Scavati, and she is the AMHA Youth Programs Coordinator. We can't wait to share the Youth Council's diversity of youth with you. Hi, my name is Grace Martin, and I've been the Vice President of the Western Region since summer 2018. I joined the Youth Council because I love Morgans in the Morgan community and want to help get youth more involved, especially in the West. I hope to get people as excited about Morgans as I am and to help provide more opportunities to come together around our love of the breed. My favorite Morgans are my geldings, Rolado del Toro and Altitude, because of their goofy, loving personalities and how they always try as hard as they can to be their best. Hi, my name is Kiana Pearson. I've been on the Youth Council for two years. I wanted to join the Youth Council originally because I really wanted to become part of something that was so national and big that could help promote the breed that I love while also collaborating with people my age. Um, I also, I really want to promote the breed. I love Morgan so much. And my favorite Morgan is my Morgan, which is Frankie, AKA Dress to Kill. Hi, my name is Taylor Johnston and I am new to the Youth Council as of this year um, and I joined the Youth Council to help promote the Morgan breed and help keep the future bright because us as youth are the future of the breed. Currently my favorite Morgan is Greycliff Tony and of course my own CBMF Carnival Ride. Hi, I am Isabella Renz and I have been on the AMHA Youth Council for two years. I joined the Youth Council because I want to involve the youth with the Morgan breed and share how special they are. One of my favorite Morgans is Rampage. Hi, my name's Allie Peek. I've been on the Youth Council for about four years now. I joined the Youth Council to help the Morgan breed influence on today's youth. My favorite Morgan is Street Smart TH. Hello, my name is Jillian Peek and I have been on the Youth Council since 2014. I joined the Youth Council because I loved networking with youth across the nation. My ambition when I joined the Youth Council was to promote the Morgan Horse to more youth. My favorite Morgan Horse is my beloved Morgan Mayor, Martha Stewart, GCH. Hi, my name is Lucy Enns and I just joined the Youth Council. And I joined the Youth Council because I'm from Kansas and I didn't see a lot of AMHA youth representation from Kansas. And I can't pick a favorite Morgan. I have two very wonderful Morgan mares and I love them both equally. Thanks everyone. Hi, my name is Clea Cloutier and I've been on the Youth Council for six years. I joined the Youth Council because promoting the Morgan breed is one of my biggest life goals. And I try to do that in every way I can on the Council. My favorite Morgan is Ledger's Tiger Lily. Hello everyone, my name is Natalie and I just recently joined the Youth Council in March. One of my goals for the Council is to work on breed promotion and sharing the joy of the Morgan Horse. My favorite Morgan is M.E.M. Levita Loca. He is currently living the life of retirement, but he was the most fun horse I have had the chance to show, and I'm very grateful to have had that opportunity.
are you interested in joining the AMHA Youth Council? The AMH Youth Council is made up of regional delegate and executive positions. To join, go to morganhorse.com and check out our Youth Council page to get an application. You have to be 12 years old to be a regional delegate and 14 for an executive position. We're holding our elections in May. Don't forget to check out our next video in June, and in the meantime, check out and like our AMH Youth Network page to learn more about the Morgan Horse, see about AMH Youth happenings, and learn more about the Youth Council. See you next time! So unfortunately, our video had a little bit of lag, um, but we'll be posting a copy of the video on our AMHA Youth Network page. So you guys can head over there tomorrow to watch that full video again if you want. Um, right now, we're gonna open it up to a little question and answer. Um, so if you have a question, the best way for you to get it to us is to type it in the chat um, and we will answer that for you. So if you have a question, send it in there now. So we have a question from Jessica, and she said, what is the Youth Council? So the AMHA Youth Council is made up of youth from across the United States. Um, we are made up of an executive committee and general membership. Um, you can join the AMHA Youth Council. It is open to all youth as long as you hold an, a youth membership with AMHA. Um, Jillian asked, how can you join the Youth Council? Um, so like we said in our video, if you go to the Morgan Horse website, you can go to our page under the youth section. There's an application there, or you can email Nikki Scavati, who is the AMHA Youth Programs Director, um, and she can also send you an application. Her email is nicole at morganhorse.com. Clea, do you want to answer the next question from Carrie? Um, sure. So we have a lot of ideas for upcoming videos. Um, I think next we're going to be doing equitation exercises. We also have offers to do videos to help our youth with the youth contest and stuff. And I think we'd also be open to taking suggestions. Yes, so we are always open to suggestions. Um, the big thing about the AMHA Youth Network is these are videos put together by youth for youth. So if you guys have any suggestions on what you'd like to see on the page, you can send us a message. You can reach out to anyone on the AMHA Youth Council. Um, Ella asked, are there any Western riders running for head positions? Well, the thing is, the AMHA Youth Council isn't really divided into disciplines. We're all just a really big group of Morgan kids who are all here because we love the horses. Um, so we're not really running for positions based on discipline, although Clea does manage our disciplines section. Um, but there's no limitation to what discipline you ride to run for a position. Cleo, would you like to take Louise's question? Um, yes, at Grand National, oh, the question, sorry, the question is, are there any events in person where the council gets together? And yes, we do at Grand National, sometimes at the smaller shows, if there are enough of us in the region, we do, but most of our meetings are done by audio calls. So Carrie asked, what are some other things the youth council does? Um, so we've put together this whole AMHA Youth Network page to connect youth across the United States. Um, and you don't have to be a Morgan youth to be a part of the AMHA Youth Network, which is a really, really awesome thing to bring everybody together. Um, and some other things we're doing, one of our projects is to put together a community service um, action for Morgan Grand National. Um, so we do a lot more than just meet up over a phone conference once a month. We are always planning things, always trying to figure out where there are gaps in the youth industry specifically so we can fill those in. Do you want to take the next question, Clea? Sure. Um, you only have to be 12 to be on the Youth Council. It's 14 for an executive position. Yep, so you only have to be 12 to join the Youth Council, like Clea said. Um, so if you are 12 and under 21, you are more than welcome to join, and we are so, so happy to have you. Um, Nikki said, do you have to show horses to be on the council? And the answer is no. As long as you hold an AMHA youth membership, you are more than welcome to join, and like we said, we'd love to have you. The next question was, can I send in a photo to you guys to post about on the network page? And yes, you can. We would love to share your photos and just send us it as a message. We can post it whenever you want. 
Um, but we do plan out some days, so there is some scheduling. So we might feature it on a trail ride Tuesday or a show season Sunday. So it all depends on what it looks like in the schedule. But we would love to share photos of youth and their Morgans. Kavita, do you want to grab Jessica's question next? Sure. Um, it doesn't cost anything to be on the council. It's, I think that's a great opportunity because especially during this time, like we all need some help in that department. Yes, yeah, so the only fee associated with being on the Youth Council is the AMHA Youth Membership Fee. Um, so Allison asked, do you have to go to nationals every year? And I believe that if you are in an executive position, you do have to come to nationals for our meeting there. Um, but you don't have to, not everyone's able to go, so it's okay. And the only thing required by youth to join the Youth Council is that you're a member. And no, you don't have to have your own Morgan horse. I just, I just lease and ride. I think a lot of us do. Yes, yeah, so the Youth Council is pretty much open to anyone who wants to join that has that AMHA membership and they fit the age requirement. So the next question was, what other activities will you be doing on the AMHA Youth Network page besides the live episodes? So we'll have our live episodes once a month. Those come out the first Wednesday of each month. Um, and then we'll be doing a lot of fun posts and interactive posts. So we're going to be doing a giveaway in the future. We like to feature all sorts of youth photos. We've been posting some interactive posts as well, like we just did a bingo, um, all to do with AMHA youth activities. So we're always looking for fun ways to connect to youth by doing interactive games, featuring their photos, and like I said, the live episodes we're going to be doing the first Wednesday of every month. Um, Jessica asked what the different positions on the council are. We have regional delegates for each re region and then vice presidents and a few other vice president positions and then the president position and those vice president positions are part of the executive council that does have to meet in Oklahoma, usually. Louisa asked when are the meetings between council members? So we meet over teleconference um, once a month usually and it is the, I believe the second Tuesday of every month, but we would have to double check. It is a once a month meeting. Um, we also have a Facebook group we communicate within almost weekly. So everyone's always posting in there, getting ideas started. Um, and all of the AMHA Youth Council members, you get to know each other pretty well. So Clea, Jessica Hyman and I have been on a committee which is presenting the AMHA Youth Network page. So we almost talk every day. So the meetings between council members can be as often as council members would like, or they can just be that simple once a month meeting with interaction through the Facebook group. Nikki asked when the elections will be for this year, and I believe the answer is May 21st. Yes, so May 21st, we're going to be having our youth council elections. So it's really important for our youth members to be active and to vote in the elections. Do we have any other questions? So it doesn't look like we have any more questions, um, but a copy of this episode will be available on our Facebook page tomorrow morning. So if you have a friend that didn't get to see this episode, make sure you forward it to them. Um, and we look forward to seeing you guys all at our next live episode, which will be the first Wednesday of June, and that will be the Equitation Workout episode. So we're really excited to get this started, and thank you all for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night.